Hi guys, happy new year. My name is Kerstin Kaza. I'm back in this new year and I am back with positive vibes. I really appreciate God for this far. So in my today's video, I'm going to talk about dating a narcissist. I dated two people and among them one was a narcissist so i'm going to talk how what i went through being dated by a narcissist who is a narcissist in the simplest way of describing who a narcissist is <laughs> a narcissist is a person <laughs> who doesn't care about your pains doesn't care about any post negative reaction that you will do to you whether you are you are, whether it is paining you or not that person doesn't care about it so it was not as, it was not easy but uh, with the time i may start by saying that uh, it is not always easy to date or to live uh, with a narcissist because one thing is this person knows very well the way he talks or the way he does to you is not good but you continue to do that thing to torture you but uh, i found myself in such a situation but i could see the red flags about the relationship but because of the love and the priority you have given to that person sometimes you don't see but sometimes you see and assume and i want to say that uh, once you realize that that person is a narcissist. Please don't assume. Leave that person as early as possible. Because sometimes it may cost your life, it may cost your time, and it may cost you everything. Yes, including your you are including your your career. Yeah. But uh, I'm lucky enough, I never got married to a narcissist. But the moment you get married to one, I think you can write on the comment section if you have ever met somebody, when, um, whoever, uh, the one who has been married by a narcissist. So if you get such a person, you know how the kind of life they live. Eh? So it's not, uh, it's not easy to meet and marry a narcissist or get married to a narcissist. That the life is never easy. So I remember I got a man and uh, right that time that man was a friend to one of my best friends. So we met through we met with that person through a friend of mine. So this is the story that I went through with. I remember the person couldn't tell me that he is coming to see me. And I remember once we're in a relationship you always expect that person to come so you expect the person to come at the right time but uh, do you know you, you I could have cooked my food clean the house and do everything good waiting for that person but do you know that person could have said I'm, I'll be there by two yes but the moment you see it two that person is not there when you call and ask him where are you now the person just tells you i'm just within i'm coming you see so you will stay there the whole day without that person and remember at night he will not even bother to call you and tell you why he is not he didn't come yeah you will assume that maybe it wasn't serious that uh, he was you took it serious that he was coming so those are the kind of those are the kind of uh, narcissistic men we have, and uh, I I could not I could feel pain, but uh, remember we have this we have the the word love, eh? and the moment you include love, you may not see so many things, eh? but that was wrong for me. It it was not supposed to be so. So the moment uh, I realized that this man is joking with my life, uh, it took me time. I continued dating the same person, but I was asking myself, for how long will I live with this kind of a person who doesn't care about even wasting my time, without doesn't care without even wasting my money, maybe cooking food for him, 
where you not even come, you know. I could solve those things, but I could assume. So the moment he planning, he, he prepares that, uh, he prepares he will be coming. Now, when he says he is coming, he may, he may come the he may come the following day, but uh, the moment he comes, he even don't say sorry of the or he will not even give the reason as to why he never came the previous day. So I used to assume eh, that uh, the more we are continuing the relationship, it will change. But uh, with the time, I came to ask myself, why am I loving this person all this much and it's like he's not concerned about me. Yeah, I start, I, through the red flags, I started now reasoning like a mature person. Because now, uh, dating an assist me means that uh, that person can stay with even for three or four years. Yes, very much together because there is that color inside. But do you know that this person knows very well in him that he's not dating you, he is wasting your time, but he will not tell you that he's wasting your time until you learn by your own. So I stayed in that relationship for a year. The second year, I started now seeing the colors of Izuri, and then I said, um, I think I should give myself a break. So I started giving myself a break from what I was going through because of what I was going through from this person. So anytime he calls, I said I will not answer his calls. Uh, the moment he texts me, I was not replying the text. So I decided to be silent on him. I kept silent for a while and uh, when I was silent, it was now the time he started now. Uh, showing up that he is very much interested in me so he could uh, he could just create time and come and see me and at the moment he come and see me i'll just forget that i had said that i'm not continuing the relationship but still i tried to love myself eh? in a way that uh, i could i could i could somehow cut myself from this person it became a time I asked myself, have I prayed for this issue or I just entered to the relationship without praying? So I just started praying. Eh? You know, there, there, are things that, sorry, 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 sorry. there are things that can make you to pray God even if you, you prayed later for them. You continue praying, continue praying. But I, I, I realize that this person maybe doesn't love me. But uh, in himself, he knows very well that he will not marry me and he doesn't love me. Yeah? He just wanted to waste myself, my, my time. Eh? And uh, it came a time when he texted me, see, I will not answer him. When he called, I will not pick the call. I decided to be silent and I prayed God. Yeah? I decided to pray God so God answered my prayers until I, 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 I continued not to take a phone, his, his phone and then now he was in the situation now that I was in I realized that after I put myself off from him I guess this is why now is time I think he was on his time now of starting dating you know there are people who will waste like you are all here saying I am going to complete this year with this lady. If I see she, is, she still continues to do like the way she is good or what, I will start dating her there the second year. Now it went there, the other way around. Eh? So I will be back with a part two of it. May you have a good day. Continue subscribing. It's a rule to 3k subscriber. May God bless you.